I've already completed my brows as you can see I'll be starting off with this shade uh, Jamila from the Saharan palette by Juvia's Place and applying that as a transition color above my crease and using just a blending brush and wiping motion from side to side and circular motions to create the shape of my eye so I'll be using this color here from the same palette and I am using that color in my crease area. It's a very matte, like, taupe color. And I'm putting that in the crease. And I'm going to also add some additional colors in my crease, too. But I wanted to use this color to kind of transition it from that bright orangey brown red color. And so I'm just kind of blending that all out, as you can see. Next I'll be going in with the color Senegal on my lids and just kind of patting that on my lids. It's a very, very beautiful gold color and I really like this color on my lids. It kind of pops and um, it's very easy to put on. I'm not sure if you guys have used the Juvia's Place palettes, but their palettes are very pigmented and they're very, very easy to apply. Um, so I'm just popping that right onto the lid and kind of blending it into the shadow that I applied in the crease. Next I'll be going in with the color Chad and another blending brush. I'm just going to tap my brush very lightly into that shade and apply that directly into the crease and use circular motions and wiping motions to create that dark area. So I'm kind of making like a smoky on the side part of my eye. I'm kind of circular, doing the circular motions on the side of the eye and then I'm going in a wiping motion in the crease, directly in the crease. I'm 
using this contour method that I saw another YouTuber. Her name was uh, Sabina. I can't remember her last name, but I saw her do something similar to this when she did her contour. And I thought it was pretty cool and I'm just trying it out myself and it actually looks like it works really really well so um, if you guys want to try that I would suggest to try it and see if it works for you I am using the black radiance pressed powder in the shade bronze glow and this is my favorite uh, thing to use for contouring my face and I'm just taking a smaller brush using that same powder and just contouring my nose And I'm going in there to highlight my face to the gods as usual with the Ofra highlighter in the shade Rodeo Dry. And I am absolutely obsessed with this highlighter lately. I've been using it like every day on my natural looks. Even if I don't wear makeup, I put a little of this in my like highlighting areas and it looks so gorgeous on my face. Now guys, I'm taking that color Chad and I'm applying that underneath my eyes and kind of smoking it out. And then I'm also going to go in there with the shade uh, Jamila, which is the first shade I applied in my transition shades. And I'm going to put that right, like blend it into the shade Chad and then push it down a little further. So it'll have like a more smokier effect. Now I'm just applying some of that Ofra highlighter, the Rodeo Drive shade, and I'm putting that in my inner corners just to add a little highlight to my inner corners of my eyes. And then I'm applying a little of that Douse Volumizing Mascara to my lashes. out and leave it in the description bar below we did receive this pencil in my boxy charm last month so um, I was super excited about trying it and I really love the shade it's a really dark berry color and it's perfect for fall or you know just whenever you want to wear that vampy type lip so I'm just putting that on and I'm also applying some onto the remainder of my lip not fully and then I'm going to add I believe some liquid lipstick because y'all know I like my liquid lipstick now guys this is 
also a matte liquid lipstick by Real Her Cosmetics. And this was also in my boxy charm last month. So it's actually a duo. It's the lip pencil and the matte liquid lips lipstick. So I am applying that and um, I don't remember the shade for this one either. So I will leave that in the description bar below and also a link where you guys can purchase it if you would like to purchase these colors. Now guys, I'm going to finish this look off with my e.l.f. setting mist and I'm going to spray my face until it looks like I just jumped out of Lake Minnetonka, honey. Yes. <laughs> and I normally apply my lashes um, when I do my eye makeup, but today I decided to do them last because they were giving me some trouble, so you know how that goes. So I saved them for last, and yeah. <laughs> and I wanted to take a few selfies. Snapchat. This is the completed look. Be sure to subscribe and thumbs up this video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.